welcome to the video my friends today we're going to check out a different loadout we're going to roll with the sparks llr somebody mentioned it in the comments in the last video and we're going to go with the negant silencer uh revolver thing just for those uh you know those quieter kills we've got a knife as well um extra meds and a stick of dynamite so yeah make basically it's the sparks llr we're going to focus on uh, we're going to see how pokey this this thing is I, i'd imagine it's a single shot and then reload so we'll just see how it goes um yeah the extra meds because you know how it's gonna go um <laughs> basically oh let's find a match go for the head on the on the waspies on the bee mamas and uh you're pretty good i'm not sure on these i guess throw flames at them but for now we'll just we'll send them off scatter them maybe i'll attract something that'll shoot at me That was freaky, man. I really thought I was I was gonna die there. We had we had them all over the place on that roof. Well, I don't know. There was maybe two. Not sure. But either way, I panicked. So I was expecting the sparks to just melt people. Hmm. It didn't so much melt people. Uh, I suppose that the guy I hit him with the sparks and then one pistol round eventually. Uh, kind of fumbled a few shots there, but. It's, it, the only downside to the sparks is it's a single shot. So I suppose to the head, you're going to get them down. Yeah, so fanning, faster rate of fire. I, I want that if you've got a, a revolver or I guess I guess it uses, works with revolvers. I'm not sure about other like the suppressed smaller revolvers. revolvers. I'm not 100% sure. Um, remain in scope view after shot. We don't really need that at the moment. Uh, we'll save those because we want stuff like light foot. Bolt jump fall and climb ladder silently uh really useful um but uh yeah reduce speed for bandages and stuff so we can heal quicker um you can build these all up as you go anyway um so let's have another go we'll, we'll do fan in with the revolver and we got a knife for, for silence um, always as well double check that you've got your meds back because they do use and then you've got to equip another one and then go back in okay let's uh let's get to it we've got to take out a few on the bridge here just clear our path so we can mosey on along i really love <laughs> the melee in this i really love it yeah, it's good it's good have i said that before i probably have but uh, it's good nice and crunchy splatty nice sound effects feel bad doing that but All right, we hit him in the ass, I think. and see him stood there with his pistol aimed did i not down that guy or was that a different guy i'm sure i downed that guy one thing i wouldn't mind seeing is a completely different kind of looking map in the future i really hope they they go that way with it um with the setting of when it is uh like an old like western town or something maybe i don't know let me know in the comments below if you've got any ideas of maps or anything like that or if you know of any being worked on because I'm a bit out of the loop with Hunt. You know, it's been, been a while since I regularly made videos on Hunt. And I'm, I'm, I want to try and get back into the loop of it. Because uh, it's a re really good game. And I think it, it doesn't get the attention it deserves. I know there's a lot of players now. But nowhere near what it deserves compared to other games that 
frankly, I don't think aren't as good. But I suppose, I suppose it's it's all taste, really, isn't it? If they if they prefer the more modern military kind of role to the the old style of this, you know, the uh, the cowboys, bounty hunters. I think it's, I think it's just cool. This my kind of thing. It's a bit of spook, but you get used to the spook and you're all right. I was pooing my pants at first. Whoa, these players are taking ages waiting for. Here we go. Just double check our guns. Love the details as well. Cry engine. Beautiful, beautiful. Oh, we got three of those. That's pretty good then. Okay, where are we going? We'll head into this place over here. Probably should have equipped them a bit better. There's always a crusty boy hanging out. Just melee them. Just melee those crusty boys. They don't like it. Well, people are already fighting over it, so let's get into it with the sparks. Let me just top my health off. Oh, I see him in the woods there. Okay, got that one. Where did this other guy go then? Wait, did he die? Did he die to the assassin? Oh my god. You're having a laugh, mate. Yeah. You got something useful for me? Not really. The thing is, I don't know how many other players are about, and this is the only bounty on this map. So I need to be very careful. Oh, he sliced me. There we go. Start that banishing process. I I can hear shots. That was like, I think it's just that heart attack. Okay, so we've got a new bounty hunter, Murdoch McGinnis. McGinnis, McGinnis. Uh, oof. Uh, yeah, same loadout, pretty much. Uh, we're just going to rock the suppressed sparks LOR this time, the silencer. And um, we'll see how the suppressor sounds. Uh, it looks like it's got a new higher iron sight to compensate for that, that huge suppressor. That is huge. So, yeah. We'll go back in with this new bounty hunter and a suppressed LRR. And there is a sniper variant as well with a nice long scope. So if we can get that unlocked, I'll try that as well in this video. Oh. Was that something? The meathead's disappeared, so... Oh no, he's still there. Oh, there we go. I think I got him. That was straight to the back of the head, I think. Oh, look what we've come across. 
Now this here, apparently, uh, just while we're here, is a Django Unchained easter egg. The scene where he shoots the dynamite, he blows up, and uh, shoots the other two guys, and shoots Tarantino when he blows up with the dynamite, and the, uh, the other guys are in the cage, the slaves. So that's an easter egg right there, just in, in this gameplay, so there's a lot, a lot of easter eggs, and we just ran across one right there. So keep your eyes out for things, references, because they're all over the place. That was a nice find, which, actually, let's look at the map, which was this location, uh, just north, uh, east of Port Rica there, up on the road in the, in the farm there, little farmland field bit. Oh, and it's kicking off at Scupper Lake. See so if we can get on this roof. One in the back. One in the legs. Come on. There's one more hit. One more hit should be a down. Come on. Stop moving. Oh, why did that not hit? That should have been a hit. There we go. That was that one more hit. Oh my god, the crows. I'm sorry, guys. Fuck, I'm, a, I'm on edge. You don't, you're not on edge so much when you're with a friend, but oh my god. When I'm with Lukic, oh, it's so, so chill and you have a laugh. When you're on your own, any little noise just freaks me out. Oh, we've got fire on the roof over there. Oh, doggies. Yep, there we go. Got a player. Uh, got dogs right behind me. Okay, I turned around just at the right time there. Uh, it doesn't mess about with dogs, this rifle, I tell you that. Okay, we got two players together over there, right underneath where I was. Hiding, they're gonna go at the top there. Is that a normal thing when you're going in solo to have loads of teamers? Is that normal? Please somebody tell me. But the suppressor works pretty good. Oh, I see. The Sniper LRR uh, earned 300 XP with 3000 XP with any Sparks LRR variant. Ah, that's pretty cool then. We'll keep trying with the Sparks and we'll try and unlock the uh, LRR Sniper for a future video. Let me just grab some knives here. So yeah, the Sparks uh, Suppressor, it works okay. We've had a couple of kills with it. It's not too bad. Um, it's nice and quiet, so you can use it to take out at long distance some beefier animals that you want to, you know, that's in your way. Yeah, it's, uh, leave a like if teaming's normal in uh, in in hunt. Is that normal, or or is there just duos in with with you as a solo? I don't know, uh, but it happens quite a bit. I've had about probably two or three, two out of three matches. There's uh, there's there's teams of duos or threes even, uh, which is, seems really weird when you're in a solo game on your own, just getting teamed on all the time. Um, is that normal? I don't know. They should be. Should they be doing it? I I don't know. Leave a like and subscribe if you enjoy the content. I create many many more hunt videos to come, as well as Daisy and other games that tickles me fancy. Soon we'll have Half Life Alex on the channel. So thank you, my friends, for all the support. A special thank you to the Patreon supporters. Continue to support me in these hard times. Uh, I love you all, and I'll see you peeps next time.